Lakers. Now, Multnomah County plans to open a new all men's homeless shelter next week in Portland's Mill Park neighborhood. And that county building borders family homes and concerned neighbors have been talking with our investigative reporter, Gabrielle Carroll, who's helping them get results. She joins us live now. What do they have to say, Gabrielle? Jeff and Eileen, this is the county building where they plan to open a homeless shelter next, next week. And as you can see, it's literally steps away from the backyards of family homes in Mill Park. Resident Chris Wheat looked up the zoning for this county building. And when he looked it up, he wasn't convinced the county was following the rules. It's close to double what the actual regulation for that property calls for. The building zoning allows for a shelter with a maximum of 75 beds. The county's plan is to open a 125 bed shelter next Friday. Wheat wanted an explanation. Part We've reached out to the Joint Office of Homeless yeah. Services. The temporary use, 75 beds is allowed by right, but the city has a process for which you can temporarily exceed occupancy limits without triggering a change of occupancy use. The county has applied for a conditional use permit through the fire department, but unlike most permits, it wasn't posted online for the public at portlandmaps.com. feels like a hidden process. It feels uh, underhanded, right? It should be all open and transparent. They have an active uh, open permit that is under review that is not publicly listed. Theralt says the county wants the neighborhood to feel comfortable. The county is mailing out invites to an open house at the shelter scheduled for next Tuesday. But Wheat says communication with residents like himself has been disappointing. I feel that I only got a response because you actually followed up with them with my very specific questions. And the response I got was limited. Your response was way more in depth than the response that they provided me. Residents were upset they weren't part of the decision process about where to locate this shelter. But as I reported last week, because the county owns this building behind me and because the county has the funds to operate the shelter, there's no public approval process. Going up on our site at coin.com, we'll have information about the open house at this planned shelter that will happen next Tuesday. And we'll also have all of our reporting on this shelter. Reporting live in Southeast Portland, Gabrielle Carroll, Coin 6 News.